Hi, welcome to Arm Wraps. My name is Randy Miller, and what you're seeing right here uh, is a ch uh, weathered chest freezer wrap, a crate. Sorry. And so, if you want to change the look of your uh, deep freezer and make it look like an old weathered crate and uh, something unique and something fun, uh, this is it. Uh, that's the top part, and these are the sides and the front part right here. And what we print out on the on the printer. We have the new HP uh, Latex 700W series printer that we printed out, so it's great quality and everything. Also, we use the 3M uh, vinyl with a matte sheen, air release channels on it, so it makes it easier for it to install. And speaking of installing, we always put markers. There's uh, installing markers right here. That's the edges of the, of the unit. For instance, this is the top part, and so... Uh, there's no second guessing where it's going to be and it lines up perfectly So we got four of those right there because this is the top part and another thing we do is did we cut this one? No, we didn't. Oh, yes So right here we cut cut the backing. It's called tacking it on On all the prints so it's easier for it to install as uh, another customer service also, we give uh, the customer a knife and squeegees. These squeegees are actually we make in-house. And so uh, the reason why we designed it is because uh, the arrow, so it's easier for you to install. Um, other than that, we before you install it, I recommend cleaning the unit with rubbing alcohol and water or uh, invisible glass spray. Um, actually, it cleans really good. I'm uh, surprised we can actually use that, but it, uh, clean it real good and kind of go from there. So... Let me show you real quick on this part right here. This is the sides, this right here, and the side, side, and the front. And we usually put the, the cut or the dots right there, the markers right there, and right there. And again, on the long part of it, oops, you can see right there is the backing. So it's, when someone's installing it, it's, it's better to, excuse the, little mess or uh okay the installing uh the the insulation uh tacking on strips right there so what i recommend is uh after it's clean and everything you can remove that tacking on strip or you can do is you bring the tacking on strip right back here pinch it so there's only the glue of the, the vinyl right there so when and what you can do next is grab your thumbs here and there and you can move it around and then when you're happy with it you just tack it on right there uh, and then we can go underneath once you're happy with it you go underneath grab that that little strip pull all the way down the, use your finger tack it down then you double check everything and what we normally do is we have an inch bleed on or half inch to an inch bleed on the left right and then also on all the prints so there's an extra bleed uh, so when that's tacked on, you move the backing about halfway over, make sure the vinyl is sticking up. And you take your squeegee, just what you're seeing right here, and what you do is you follow the arrows. That's the reason why you make these arrows on these squeegees, you just follow these arrows. You get one of these. And a knife. So once that is done, you do the front, you do the sides next, you line up the li uh, lines and everything. It should be perfectly lined up if you follow these little markers right here. Again, uh, for instance, another prime thing, this will be the front of uh, the, the unit and also the back of the unit. So you're going to actually have an inch overlap, what you're seeing right there. So if it's right right about there, when you're when it's installed on the unit, you grab your knife and then you cut straight down and then it'll be a nice clean cut. Um, also, this is the same thing for the, the doors or um, actually the, the top unit. So if you want something like this, you go to armwraps.com website, go to um, freezer wraps. Uh, we should have it on the website pretty soon. We don't have it right now, but the customer is requesting it, so we made a custom buy button. Uh, but we will add this on there. But if you need it right now, uh, just email me at rmwraps at gmail.com or call me, 208-696-1180, and say, hey, I'd like to have this one. And then we'll put it on the website because we're bouncing all around right now, doing a lot of things. We have a lot of prints and a lot of jobs we're doing right now. So we're just focusing on putting the fires out right now. So other than that, uh, stay tuned. we got more videos. I'm going to do another video on this one right next. And I'll show you on that one right there. So stay tuned. All right. See you next video.